Hey everyone, it's RipPro. Welcome back to another episode of Tears of the Kingdom. So, first, before we explore Kakariko Village, let's take care of the shrine. an upright device. So that means ascend. That's gonna be the theme of this one, I'm guessing. There we are. So we're gonna see what this does. Okay, so it automatically sits itself upright. How far can I set this? Huh. What am I supposed to do? Let me see what striking it does. Oh. Okay. So, let me grab this. Can't put it over there, so that's not really helpful. Maybe I need to survey my surroundings a bit more. Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Can also try this. Let me put this near the edge. There we go. And I can glide over. And there we are. Grab this through here. Can I? No, I cannot. Well, let's see how I can make my way over there. I can grab this. I've gotta keep my eye out for a chest, so let me see about just putting it right here. I don't think that's gonna get us all the way. Yeah. I think I have to glide over from somewhere. Let me go back up here. Nope. Yeah, I can't glide from there. Wait, can I grab that from over here? No, I cannot. I grab this. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, I think I have an idea. Kind of clever. I 
And now... Boom! Now I need to grab this and stick it right here. And that should open this. So. Oh, am I going to have to launch myself? That actually might be kind of fun. So, what parts I need? Need that. And this. Go ahead and just turn this off. Let's line it up. And let's hope I'm right. I might not have been. I might not have been. Oh no, oh no. Well. How much damage is that going to do? One heart. Let's see what else um, it's a possibility. That might not be it. Hold on just a second. Alright, I think I know what to do, but first, hold on a second. I don't think I checked out this room for anything I need. There is something in there. Hold on a second. Grab another construct bow. I'm sure we'll find another actual bow soon. All right. So, um, I think I need. No, no, no! Wrong way. Wait, hold on. What am I doing? No, that's not it. Alright, so Ultra Hand. Oh my god, why did it fall like that? There. There we go. All right, so now. And now I need to put this right here. It'll just get us a little bit more leverage. Hey, wait, hold on. There we go. Whoa. 
Whoa, hello. That's all the way to the roof. But that's the kind of catapult we're going to need for the last leg of this. There we go. <sighs> Very tonic. Cool. So I'm going to send back ready. Let's head on up. No, wrong one. My bad. No, no, run away, run away. Alright, so I'm gonna rest this right here. And now, let's hit that. And just glide on over. And there we go. Perfect. And we should be able to skip this one as well. We got a light of blessing. Number six. All healed up. Now we can go explore Kakariko Village. Alright, so... Probably have to jump and go down. What's this? Southern Ring Ruin Research Journal, Cory. Like the other ring ruins, those that fell to the plateau south of the village also held a stone slab with Zona inscriptions. Curiously, we also discovered a flower growing in the ruin, the likes of which we had never seen. References in ancient texts revealed that it was a um, sundelion, a plant long thought extinct. We are currently borrowing... Um, a local pl plum orchard um, for our cultivation efforts and hope to um, hope hoping our studies prove fruitful. Note: our investigation of the round device filled with strange objects has meanwhile come to a standstill. Alrighty. Silent shroom. Where's the... There it is. So, um, let's... Just go ahead and do this real quickly. See how much it get, gets us. So we get balloon. Huh. Big wheel. We've already seen that. Stabilizer, we already saw that. Cool. So, I do want to find, uh, um... Sticky frog, okay. A goddess statue somewhere. Might have to just search around town. And saying this looks promising. This looks like a temple-ish area. So maybe, or maybe not. All right. Nothing up here, but 
It was, it was at least it was at least worth a look. Just want to look around a bit. Hello. Got a sticky frog. You're here, here to see the sights, right? Let me guess. The sights you want are the Ring Ruins and Kakariko Village. I'm, I'm right, aren't I? <laughs> but then you don't have to be um, a psychic to figure that out. After all, you can't find ruins like that anywhere else. Oh, but don't let me keep you. Kakariko Village is right down the road. Have fun. Gotta find where that goddess statue is. Killing me only having um <laughs> having six lights of ruin without being able to turn them into like health or stamina. The six lights of blessing. I don't know what I said. Lights of blessing. Ooh, it's lagging here. All right, let's see what's up in Kakarigo Village. Also, let me go ahead and just delete that pin. There's some fireflies. Oh, hello. Leslie, Leslie. What to do? At this rate, Grandmother's health isn't going to... Uh, and Clary's um, so busy running the clothing shop. I'll just have to do it myself. I'll find a cure for my grandmother. What's wrong? Are you a traveler? I guess it doesn't really matter who you are, so as long as you're willing to listen. You see, it's my grandmother. She got too close to the nasty gloom stuff, and now she's sick and bedridden. Porridge is about the only thing she can keep down um, right now, too. I've been trying to make some ingredients that um, could help with gloom sickness, but none of them have um, have had any effect. I need to cook porridge um, that will make my grandmother better, and I need to do it soon. Porridge? It's my grandmother's favorite, made of Hylian rice, fresh milk, and wild greens. Might not normally think to mix those ingredients, but surprisingly good. I bought a, bu um, a bunch of Hylian rice and milk from merchants who travel the road um, to the west, so I'm not hurting for those. But still haven't found that crucial ingredient um, that fights off gloom sickness. Gloom? I don't really know um, anything about it myself, other than what it does to you when you touch it. My grandmother was cleaning up East Hill... Um, for the survey team when she first noticed the chasm. We know that the chasm's a source of gloom, but she had no idea. When she um, tried to take a look, she got exposed. But there's got to be an ingredient that counteracts gloom sickness somewhere um, out there, right? <laughs> Alright, cool. Gloomborn illness. Oh, is this one I can track? Hmm. I'm gonna look around, maybe in houses. This is Grandma. Nana. I don't know who you are, but I'm sorry you have to see me like this. I'm dealing with an illness and don't have the strength to get up. If this is about the clothing shop, please talk to Clary. Illness? Oh, I got too close to the chasm. That's when I accidentally touched that gloom. Seems to have taken quite a toll on my uh, me at my age. But don't worry, I'm alright for now. My granddaughter, Lasley, is looking after me. She should be just outside the house. The poor girl's worried about me. I need to get better soon. Right, give me just one second. Alright, I think I should be fine. I don't know why I feel like I really need to like hunt for it. It's I think just like right in the middle of the village. Ah! 
What just happened? Y'all heard that, right? Is it because I fell in their pen? This is Melly's cherished plum garden. If it, oh, it's the guard <laughs> guard cuckoos. If anyone but her goes in, the guard cuckoos attack at once. Though I guess that warning comes a little late now. There's also an important experiment in cultivating sundial lions um, going on here, so that's an even better reason not to enter. Yeah, thanks for the heads up. Appreciate it. At least it didn't actually take any health from me. Alright, let's pray. I've been taking a lot of damage. This one is going to be a heart container. The next one will be a um, stamina wheel. You got a heart container! Woo! Go and bring peace to the world. Alright. So, let's head up to the clothing shop, see what's up for sale. Hope grandmother be okay. Huh? Oh, uh, welcome. Sorry, I must have drifted off. I'm just so tired lately. Uh, look, I know it won't um, help to talk about it, but I'm going to anyway. My grandmother's really sick. I'm running the shop while my little sister, Lasley, is looking after her. We're sort of getting by, but we're both so exhausted. I'm sorry about this, but we really need money for grandma, grandmother's treatment. I've had to hike up prices on everything we have in stock. It's just um, for now, though. As soon as grandmother is healthy again, I can set her prices back to normal. Uh, I know I shouldn't bring my home situation into the shop with me. It's nice to get off my chest, but I probably shouldn't have dumped all that on a customer. Okay, time to salvage my professionalism. Ah. I'm so sorry about that. Allow me to um, welcome you to Enchanted. Ah. Anyway, you can't get your hands on... CC brand fashion unless you go to unless you go southeast to Hata, um, Hateno Village but why go there when you can meet all your fashion needs um, right here we serve um, we serve both style and quantity hey. all right let's see what I can sell okay <laughs> let me just So a couple things. <laughs> All right, there's a couple things here, but I think we're probably gonna need to figure out what how to help Grandma first. What's this? Ring of Ruins. Oh, this. That's probably what Ring of Ruins is, I guess. They're all so high up. Um. I'll go ahead and accept the quest. I'm not doing it right now, though. Hey there, kid. Did you come see the Ring of Ruins, too? We might bump into each other when you're running around the village. Seeing the sights. If you want to learn about the ring ruins, be sure to ask the Zonai survey team uh, people here, or the village chief. You'll find her and a few team members under one of the ring ruins. The one floating on the north side of the village. Ring ruins? Heh. <laughs> They're only the most amazing sight to see in Hyrule. Of all the ruins that fell everywhere, these ring-shaped wonders are um, only in this village. Five of them. They found a stone slab with Zonai writing 
um, in four of the ruins. Those ancient messages um, are the main reason I came to this village. Problem is, I have an extreme fear of heights. My legs start shaking if I'm even on the second floor of a house. And, the, um, and every um, ring ruin fell somewhere high up. One of those ru one of the ruins is floating above part of the village, so at least I can see it from below. The other four, though, forget about it. I can't even get close. I wish I could find out what's on the stone slabs in each of those ruins. All right, cool. Uh, hold on, just a minute. All right, I think we, let's go talk to her. See what we can do. So I think I have the missing ingredient. Oh, no, 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 I don't want to sit. Uh. Let me put a summonator. Porridge. Highland rice, fresh milk, and wild greens. So the road to the west. Alright, so maybe I'll um, see if I can check that out. Is it up here? Probably not. Ew. Oh, what? What did I do? Mm. Have you heard? You the other rig run by Princess Zelda's orders. Princess Zelda's orders? You heard me. Princess Zelda came out to Kakariko Village the other day and told everyone to steer clear to the ring run. Oh. She left in a hurry. So I didn't quite catch it from the why of it all. As you surely noticed, the ruins could come crumbling down at any time. So folks um, need to keep away so they don't get injured. I'm sure that um, that's where her concerns were coming from. Okay, weirdo. Alright, so let me follow this road. See if I can come across the merchant that she was talking about. Wait, hold on. There's produce. Could this be it? Black bird egg. Maybe not. Especially if that's it. Hi. Paragraph uh. monsters. All right, I guess we have another quest. Ah. That wasn't really helpful, now was it? Curious quiver. Yeah, not really what we need right now, but we'll see. This episode's running long, but I might just have to let it. Let's go a little bit out. See if we can find the merchant. If not, we'll probably just pick this up next time. Uh, 
Ah, so bright. Oh, no, that's not him. That's the weirdo. Yeah. Are you... Oh, oh you don't know? <laughs> okay. Ah. Come on, I don't want to have to read so much. A piece of... Okay. <laughs> My strike here, fashionable, fancy. Now, do we have? Do you have a map? Uh. I've heard. It. Okay. Cool. So I guess these are the areas we have to go to at some point. <laughs> oh. Great fairies. Fairies have existed throughout Hyrule and have been known to bless clothing. But since so much ugliness came to our land, I've heard that they've withdrawn from view. Though I think one of them was seen near Woodland Stable in the north lately. What could that be all about? Ah. Oh, sorry. I've gone on and on. It's been a while since I've been able to talk fashion with anyone. Time for me to get back to searching for Misko's legendary outfits. Good luck and goodbye. So I think I'm gonna have to figure this out some other time. I might have to figure it off on ca um figure it off camera and I'll do it next time. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.